The discovery of a 5,000-year-old society in Morocco, outside the Nile Valley, reveals an ancient farming culture. At the site known as Oued Bet, archaeologists uncovered evidence of a large farming settlement where people used advanced techniques. New research is changing how historians understand ancient farming culture. This society not only practiced advanced farming techniques but also likely traded goods with other cultures. The site, known as Oued Bet, was originally uncovered by French colonists nearly 100 years ago, but has since been overlooked. The study authors had a strong sense that the area was due for further examination, and gathered a team of experts to excavate it. At the site, the team found an abundance of stone tools and pottery shards. Radiocarbon dating of preserved organic materials placed the culture around 3,400 BCE. The team also gained insights into the ancient people's diets. Seeds discovered in large, constructed pits revealed that the civilization cultivated barley, wheat, peas, pistachios, and olives. Additionally, the remains of sheep, goats, pigs, and cattle demonstrated their reliance on livestock. Previously, researchers believed the area was populated by nomadic peoples who followed the grazing paths of herd animals and hunted and gathered for food. This new research proves that some societies in the area were stationary and practiced Neolithic techniques such as farming, growing crops, and raising animals. What archaeologists doing is not plonking down a single farming society into a pastoral world. They show that this part of the world has gone fully Neolithic and that this is part of the big world of farming. And that is just the tip of the iceberg. According to the research, the society in Oued Bet was a large-scale farming settlement roughly the size of early Bronze Age Troy. The people who lived in the area likely came from various genetic backgrounds and places such as the Sahara, Iberian Peninsula, and Middle East. The researchers believe there has been a significant gap in archaeological knowledge of the area between 4000 and 1000 BCE. The discoveries prove that this gap has been due not to any lack of major prehistoric activity but to the relative lack of investigation and publishing. Ued Bet now affirms the central role of the Maghreb in the emergence of both Mediterranean and wider African societies.